I'm Jane, I'm from Art2427 and today I'd like to show you this painting. I love this painting, it's so colourful, we have so many different colours on here and so much texture, it's, the painting just shows life, this painting is full of life, full of joy, it's actually called He Inhabits the Praises of His People. Who inhabits the praises of his people? God. So we've got this bursting forth of praises coming out of the mouth of people who love him, coming out of the mouth of those who are following Jesus. Their praises are coming out of their mouths and just bursting, exploding up to God, praising him in, in words or in song. Now, when we praise, um, praise God, when you know him and you love him, this is what happens because he inhabits the praises. He's in it. He's in all this praise. If you're um, worshipping Jesus in church, you're singing to him, you're praising him, you're worshipping him. This is what is happening because he actually inhabits us. He inhabits us and he inhabits his praises. And so when we're worshipping him in church or at home, wherever we are, in the car, wherever we are, it's very, very real. We're not just singing. We're not alone. He's with us inhabiting these praises. So if you're just singing, like you may be at a wedding or you may be at some kind of church service, where people are not born again and they don't have Jesus living inside them but they're learning about him more as a good person or a person of history but he's not actually living inside them then it would just be singing and lots of people have the most wonderful voices far better than mine but if Jesus isn't inside these people they will be singing these songs singing, enjoying it, enjoying the experience, singing is enjoyable, but it won't be real. It won't be real to God and it won't be real to you. It will just be you having a nice time or a good time because you're singing and singing is good. It's enjoyable. But when you know Jesus, when you're a Christian, he actually inhabits your praises. He inhabits your praises. So if you're not with people, who know Jesus, you, you need to get around them. You need to come to church when they invite you to church. You need the life of Jesus for God to inhabit the praises of his people, his people. And so when we do praise him and thank him and worship him, you get this explosion coming out of us that God inhabits. And it's wonderful and it's dynamic and it's powerful and things happen when we're worshipping God. We're not just singing to God. We're not just singing wonderful, amazing, incredible songs. Because in Christianity there are so many incredible songs, wonderful worship, incredible. We're not just singing these songs. We're worshipping him. We're praising him with all our might because we love him, because we have that release in us. So I hope you enjoy this painting. And don't forget all our paintings are for sale. And, um, you know, I'd love someone to purchase this painting to be reminded all the time that when you're praising God, when you're praising Jesus, he is inhabiting your praises and it's explosive. It's explosive, it's dynamite. So maybe you'd like to purchase this for yourself or for a friend. And remember, we keep our costs very low. Our paintings are really low priced because we want people to be um, easily able to afford them. You know, a lot of our paintings can be the same price as going to the hairdressers. And, and once you've got one of these, it's for life. And it will always remind you of the joy, the bursting forth, the, what happens when you're praising God, that he's actually inhabiting those praises as he inhabits you. And things happen in the supernatural spiritual realm 
because of it. So I hope you've enjoyed me talking about this painting today. Thanks for watching and we'll see, I'll see you, I'll see you next time on Art 24 27.